This is a 60-year-old male patient presents with a sudden onset of chest tightness, dyspnea, and syncope. Additionally, he reports progressive swelling in his right leg over the recent period. The patient has a past medical history significant for hypertension and hyperlipidemia. On presentation, the patient's vital signs were as follows. Consciousness, clear and alert. Oxygen saturation, 99%. Temperature, 35.3 degrees Celsius. Pulse rate, 71 beats per minute. Respiratory rate, 26 breaths per minute. Blood pressure, 106 over 68 millimeter mercury. Laboratory findings. NT-Pro BNP, less than 70 picogram per milliliter, within normal range. Troponin I, 0 0.1280 nanogram per milliliter, elevated. D-dimer, 13,646 nanogram per milliliter, significantly elevated. Chest X-ray, cardiomegaly, no lung edema, no pneumonia, no pneumothorax. ECG, normal sinus rhythm. Discussion. What is the most likely diagnosis? What confirmatory test should you order? The most likely diagnosis is pulmonary embolism, as shown in the CT pulmonary angiogram below. CT pulmonary angiography is the confirmatory test for pulmonary embolism. Take-home message. Always consider deep vein thrombosis if leg edema is observed. Pulmonary embolism can present with syncope. ECG can be normal in pulmonary embolism. Note, sinus tachycardia is more common than S1Q3T3 pattern in pulmonary embolism. Chest X-ray is commonly non-diagnostic in pulmonary embolism. Do not rely on D-dimer in decision-making if pretest probability of pulmonary embolism is high. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to our channel by clicking the subscription button. If you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment below in the comment section.